right, it has been a while since we last played anime card battle, but the game just got updated literally, I think two or three days ago. So apparently this new update, they've added in support cards, uh, a brand new lobby and a couple of other things that I have yet to read through on the Discord update log. But I'm pretty excited to be back on the game. The game's been popping off since um, you know we've last played. It keeps growing every time. Uh, I, I, the game's hovering at a 23, 24,000 player count right now, which is just absolutely insane. But I'm glad to see the game is getting consistently updated because it means that we have new things to do every couple of days so i'm not gonna waste any more time we're gonna dive into this and try to have some fun so now i'm grinding dolo in they absence no but i'm still sticking to the plan because i mapped it no and i don't care about going slow just not backwards If you didn't drop a like on the video, this centipede is going to crawl into your ear while you're falling asleep tonight. If you don't want that to happen, then drop a like on the video. Okay, guys, we are in game. And as you guys can see, if you have been playing this game for a while, um, the game has a brand new lobby. Um, so this actually looks pretty big. Um, it looks like it's like the hidden leaf entrance. It is actually. Um, so that's pretty cool. They've added in... Uh, I don't know what's up with these games in these lobbies now adding in like these little run markers um I, I'm, not, I'm not opposed to it but I, I just feel like every lobby does it now <laughs> you know what i'm saying um but i mean it, it, i guess maybe people complain about it you know what i mean I, I don't know um so but anyway we have a potion shop over here daily reward chest let me actually interact with this there we go we got a couple of daily rewards there uh we have a car index with Neruto here this is pretty cool um i i like ooh. actually i can claim a lot of these rewards oh 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 my god brother you see this <laughs> i can claim a lot of these rewards here which is pretty dope um so yeah we are missing a good bit of cards brother um we have a good amount of them as well though so that's pretty good anyway uh ooh, nice we have a sandstorm brother. let me activate uh some of my luck stuff so let me use like a, a luck two potion We'll do like a, uh, a speed two potion and I'll preserve the other ones. I'm not going to use any of these just yet, but we got a decent amount of potions in our inventory for sure. Um, anyway, this is the first game that I'm playing that actually did something that I think most other Roblox games should do. And I always advocate for them to do it where it's like a lot of games, they launch and they're very low effort and they just continue to be very low effort. Uh, however, this game, it's like it launched, it uses AI art, but they're looking for artists and now like the lobby's been revamped. So it's like, they're actually, you know, putting money back into the game. Most other devs they don't do that. Um, and it's very sad to see, cause it's like a cash grab will always be a cash grab, but I, I, I guess not in this case. Right? So we have card packs over here with this NPC. He says, would you like to look at my card packs? Sure. Oh, I, okay. This NPC we've already seen in the last video, um, which, you know, that NPC was added in the the last update uh so they have heaven's arena now which is in this building and okay there's a potion over here the fountain guy is here is this still 79 bobux or did they upgrade them prizes they're like oh it's even cheaper it's uh 70 bobux or was it always 70 bobux slash 69 maybe it was that instead of 79 i don't know why i think i, I thought it was 79 but uh, anyway uh we do have a charm shop here here's the merchant uh this is who you're gonna come to of course to craft your charms um i did actually make this stand arrow i think i made this off camera i don't think i showed you this guys unfortunately um i do have a couple of these cards i'm missing gilgamesh and saber for the holy girl artifact slash uh, uh what, what do they call it charm right unfortunately uh so that's gonna take some time to get you guys know this game it's pretty difficult to get like the 0.5 uh so like 1.5 million 2.5 million like 750 850 like the point fives right um it, it's really difficult to get those type of cards i don't really know why the two million car like almost everybody and their mother has it um but it's just these other cards that are pretty tough to get but um so yeah so like i said i craft a stand arrow and that's off camera that's currently what i have equipped um so that that is super beneficial it doesn't seem they added any new charms at all uh here's the leaderboards okay that's pretty cool and now they have bosses over here and portals so i think this is a much better way to actually get the portal system done i think they should have done rooms i don't know what you guys think about that but you know like tower defense games uh have rooms and stuff like that i think they should have done rooms in this game that way it's like they can add an infinite amount of like just updates for um 
these areas, right? Like these portals, eventually it's going to get to the point where it's like they don't have enough space for all the portals in here. You know what I'm saying? Um, so I think they should have just done a room. You go into the room and then you choose like what world you want to teleport to. Um, but they do have world info, like podiums and stuff, like with a book, you see, uh, where you can interact with and you can see who um, and what is located in that specific portal. So apparently uh, the boss rewards for defeating um, generals, I mean, not generals, excuse me, Boros, uh, is basically a 20 times luck every 5,000 rolls. So that's that's pretty crazy to be honest with you. Um, it's, it's gonna take a long time for me to get there, but <laughs> all right, we can try, we can try, right? Okay, so we have some battle pass stuff. I actually have a yeah, I have a lot of battle pass stuff that I can claim. So let me let me go ahead and claim these, and I will catch you guys in a second here. By the way, actually, um, just want to let you guys know that all these things that I'm collecting is not me even playing the game. Like I literally like the last video that you guys saw on the channel. I AFK'd for like another six hours or so after that video, I'm not gonna lie to you. And uh, that's pretty much what has gotten me all these rewards. So I'm almost maxed out on the battle pass, which is pretty cool. We also have some quests already that we can complete, which is also pretty nice. And um, I don't know when I got Nami. I don't know if I've always had Nami, but this is my current inventory. Ooh, I have also the Crimson Demon. Um, so yeah, there are some units here that you guys have not seen from my, um, my previous deck, like Older Brother, this card, the one. Um, I have like a lot of different units. Uh, I actually did not notice any of these units until now. Um, and I don't know if they've actually changed up the art on some of these cards, but yeah, things are looking a little bit different to me. Um, especially that Akito. I, I, don't, I don't know. Anyways. Okay. So here's like the update log for the latest update. Um, like I said, they added in the new lobby, which I just showed you guys. They added in support cards, which you can only start rolling support cards after you defeat the King of Curses. So I don't know if it auto unlocks or if I have to go back and defeat him again, but I'm gonna do it just in case. Apparently they've also added in double jumping and dashing. Oh, they did. Yo, the dash in the air is actually pretty nice and it's different from the one in the ground. Um, so yeah, this is pretty cool. I feel like Anime Defenders is, is behind uh, this uh, system um, or use of this system at uh, as domineering as it is now like it basically th th this type of mechanic wasn't frequented before in games um and I've, I've said this before even the first time that i played anime defenders like my own um tower defense game we have a movement system um very similar not exactly like this obviously but very similar that's all i'm gonna say uh but we never had like these arrows and movement buffs for speed and stuff like that so um yeah, I, now that I think about it, that kind of answers my question. Like in, in the beginning of the video, I was like, I don't, I don't know why these games are always adding in these arrows to the lobbies now. And it's like, obviously, yes, it speeds things up. Players can get the things faster. But I think like, I think it has to do with anime defenders um, and the success it has had. And people are just like, oh, it, it works. <laughs> so let's do it too, right? All right. So they've also added in like, you know, the index system that I also showed you. Uh, World info, which I showed you. They added a new weather, which is manga. Wow. Okay. And that gives you three new cards. So they added a new card no to the galaxy weather and art rework for most of the cards in the game. Oh, no wonder I was wondering, like I told you guys, like stuff looked different and yeah, there's an art rework for most cards in the game. I don't know if they're actually using actual artist pictures now or what, but uh, that's been done. And then they have a new card pull animation for cards above 10 million and hundred million. Yikes. I'm not gonna lie to you gang. I don't think we'll ever see that. I mean, maybe we might get lucky on video but if we ever get like 100 million or 10 million or something that card is more than likely going to be obtained off camera while i'm afk <laughs> right i mean we're coming up on the a thousand spin luck boost so maybe we might get lucky there i don't know but um anyhow let me go ahead and uh, defeat the the king of curses which uh i forget if it's this limitless king okay yeah this is this is the the portal so mr king of courses <laughs> or curses excuse me prepare to die brother i'm gonna end you <clears throat> what the hell oh that's right i was using um itadori because of his 10 percent chance to deal five times damage which when it procs is just a stupid amount of damage you know what i mean also natsu for the flame damage um Actually, I just realized they literally balanced the game um, and reassessed the damage that your cards do because, interesting, my card demon, I'm pretty sure my card demon and my other cards were doing way more damage than the damage they do right now. Uh, so that is, yeah, 
that's very unfortunate um let me let me set up a new deck right uh they actually have a support party on the left hand side so how do we know if it's a, if a card is a support card oh there it is okay so you gotta click card deck and then it brings up the support deck so right here we have a wooden long it gives your card a 10 percent chance to dodge what the heck okay so i have two of them i don't know how often you'll get um support items or cards but it does not seem too often if i've been getting it this whole time i've been uh rolling uh, otherwise if i just unlock support cards by defeating the king of curses right now uh that's pretty cool uh, by the way th this um I, well i got confused but i meant to say th this is pretty cool lelouch looks mad cool this card is awesome um what i meant to say about the support card is that that's pretty fast if i literally just got these just right now you know what i mean uh, I'm going to go ahead and look at these different cards that I have, guys. I'm going to try to figure out what is the best deck loadout that I can have. And we'll try to see if we can defeat either Saitama or, or uh, Boros. Because, yeah. I mean, I actually, I think I've defeated Saitama already last video. It was just Boros that was just dumb difficult to uh, to kill, you know? Because apparently, like, literally when you kill him, he revives with full health and goes into full, uh, full I don't know, like a phase two or something. I don't, I don't know. It's just, it's, it's stupid. It really is. Okay, guys. Also, we are about to do our 1,000 super roll here, and we got Vegeta. <laughs> All right. Beautiful. Um, So I have a super generic team loadout right now. I'm going to show you guys the deck. Uh, so we have Nami first, which uh, on entry, she steals 10% of the enemy's um, HP, uh, which is dope, right? Then we have our um, Escanor, where he becomes strong during the day, but weak at night. So right now, I think it's night outside, which uh, he might be weak, but I don't know. We'll see. Uh, obviously, you know, the Enkidu card, or however you want to pronounce it, uh, always have had this card and use it. Uh, that's pretty good. And then we have... Uh, the sakura card capture whatever the heck this this uh girl is from at what anime this girl is from um so we have her last because she deals three times damage but she's stunned for one turn so it's like there we go you know you finna be last okay so again not a spectacular deck by any means just very basic we're gonna try it out on saitama and we'll see how it goes so there we go we took 15 percent of his health um that's bad yeah oh my god Escanor is not doing any damage um Okay, this is pretty good. We attacked two times, knocked him out, and there you go. Okay, we got that done. That was pretty good. Um, apparently, now you can hide the battle when you're battling people, which is pretty cool. I don't know if you guys realize that, but... Oh, actually, let me uh, let me get out of here so I can see if it's nighttime outside. Yeah, it definitely is nighttime outside. So when the heck is it going to become daytime? Let me wait until it's daytime, and then we'll try to use Escanor. And hopefully he just obliterates. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> that would be phenomenal because, um, yeah, he sucks. During the nighttime right now, my boy. Yeah, man, that, that brother, that brother is starving. Um, additionally, let me see how he looks like. Oh, my God, that's pretty cool. Look at that. Yeah, man, that, that card effect is pretty cool. So let me go into the deck again. Um, I've actually never even checked out. Yeah, baby girl is going to give somebody a seizure, so let me stop. Nami, how about you, baby girl? Nami is also... She's okay. I think I'm gonna stick to baby girl. I'm gonna stick with baby girl. Um, or I can literally just use Escanor because Escanor he just looks so cool, bro. So right now it's raining. By the way, they have a whole crafting system in the game. I forgot to do that real quick. Let me um let me check this out. I think it's either like in the DBZ world or let me let me see. I don't know. I'm confused. Actually, no, I lied. It's not in the DBZ world. Is it in the Naruto world? No, it is not. Okay, I don't I don't know where the heck this NPC is, but there is a potion mixing NPC. Actually, ironically, I think it might be in the JJK world because I think it's like around here somewhere. Or why am I going the wrong way? <laughs> I forget. It's on the on the right hand side. I was following that one guy. Wait, what the hell? Wasn't there like a shop around here, like on the right hand side? Oh, okay. So the One Piece world, I think, is the one because they have. Uh, yeah, there you go. Oh wait, this is card fusion. Mm, intriguing. Well, let me just use all these cards over here because I have like an insane amount of these cards and uh okay there you go we got a bunch of stuff Very cool guys i don't know gang um i, I i'm uh, I, i'm so confused at this point i'm, I'm like really lost because this is definitely where that potion shop is supposed to be at right I, i'll show you guys so like literally if you go over here it says potion shop rollable support cards um 
I'm confused. <laughs> I'm gonna have to look up a video or something. I don't know. Oh, the potion shop is up here. What am I? Doing? Oh my god. All right. So I guess literally what they've decided to do is to just make everything that you can interact with, as far as like NPCs or shops like that, uh, in the main space. Yeah. All right. I'm blind. All right. Anyway, cool. Found that without having to do a video, by the way, which is amazing, right? It's super duper amazing. So let's craft all our uh, speed two potions and our um, luck two potions over here, as you guys can see. Pretty easy stuff. So we can also make luck three potions. I just don't think it's worth it to make luck three. I think it's worth it to make luck two or speed two, but not speed three and luck three. I just don't. All right. So I want to use a, a, a luck three, right? Let's see how long that lasts. Oh my God. A thousand two hundred seconds. Isn't that like 20 minutes? Yeah, I'm tripping. <laughs> it's worth it, gang. Just go make three or something. I don't know. All the time, every time, baby. You know what I'm saying? So you end up using five uh, tier twos to make a luck three by the way, or, or speed three, but I think uh, it lasting that long is 100,000% worth it in my opinion. Um, so let's also use a speed three potion. Um, let's actually use uh, two of each. Why not, right? We have a lot of them now. That's also another thing that I really like about this game is the fact that um, you don't really have to do a whole lot to like get really good like crafting items, you know what I'm saying? Um, whether that be for the potions or the actual charms in the game, which is pretty dope. So anyways, it is still nighttime. I don't know when it'll ever be daytime, but I, I'm going to keep waiting and believing, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to keep waiting and believing, and then we'll uh, we'll try to get um, Escanor to, to go up against some... Um, well, actually, we can try to see how badly we get whooped right now <laughs> against Boros, but yeah, this is going to be like so tough, dude. All right, he says, I wish to find someone who can match me. Are you strong? Of course. All right, so I'm currently in battle. Um, we, we took a little bit of his HP. Escanor does no damage. You guys are seeing that. Baby girl's gonna attack two times here and get destroyed. And then this girl's gonna also attack and get destroyed. Uh-huh. Right. So, I don't know if you guys saw uh, Bodos' card description, but literally when he dies, he revives with 50% health. So that's what's really going to mess me up. But I mean, hopefully, like, Escanor during the day can save us. Or I can just simply, like I mentioned before, um, try to get lucky with Itadori. Even though Itadori, I'm pretty sure, got nerfed because I don't remember that he had 286 damage on his attack. I thought it was way higher than that. Actually, never mind. I lied. I, I just checked my old video. And yeah, Itadori's still doing the same amount of damage. So, um, yeah, it's still pretty good, I guess, because that's like about, like, what is that like almost right 1500 damage if we have him in the party and he procs that uh first ability but i i think maybe uh nami's ability is better maybe 10 percent of the opponent's health and then she does 434 so that's 100 guaranteed you know what i mean let's just see let's see how does it tell us how much uh Boto's health is and he has no he just it just says that he has 1900 attack power which is just dumb like it's so much bro <laughs> so much there's not one card on my team that can literally take his hits bro okay let's try this right i'm gonna put in um nami i'm gonna try gojo because gojo has 700 health and the dude has like 1900 so it's like a one in one to three uh ratio um for him to be able to dodge Boto's attacks right and then jotaro is pretty dumb as well like with the amount of uh, i mean with like his ability that can proc 20 percent chance is top time um so that's that's kind of crazy and then maybe we can do like the crimson demon right because like maybe like i don't know we'll just try this is this might be a, a dumb deck as well but I, whatever we're just throwing stuff together to try to beat Bodos. So you know what i'm saying let's see how this goes so okay life seal plus uh, the the tag did pretty decent um dodge please okay never mind time stop please uh never mind <laughs> oh my days Okay, this is bad. This is bad. I, I went horrible, but we keep trying, brother. We keep trying until the RNG gods. There you go. Lucky. Okay, not so lucky. Lucky. Not so lucky. Lucky. Not so lucky, actually. All right, what the hell, brother? Well, I mean, at least we got that 10%. That, that support card was actually pretty decent. Um, Came in kind of clutch at the wrong time, though, if I happen to say so myself. And we got some more support cards now. Boost health by 10%. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, let me get two of those, brother. Of course. Oh, my God. Do these stack? 
<laughs> I don't know, right? Oof. Okay, we got the time stop to proc. The only unfortunate part was that, uh, yeah, we got destroyed. Um, our Gojo did absolutely nothing, man. Gojo, Gojo kind of, kind of sucks in the game. I'm not gonna lie, dude. And it's freaking nighttime even still, bro. Nighttime lasts forever, man. I'm never gonna be able to check out this Escanor class or card, excuse me. Look at that. Jotaro just got the time stop again, but Gojo just like he can't do nothing. Man, sucks. All right, I'm trying a different co a card loadout, excuse me, right over here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you guys see it play out because hopefully it'll go well. Nice. Okay. 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 Wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. Watch the burn damage, baby. Delicioso. Okay. Natsu is just a sacrifice. Time stop, please. Bastard. All right. If I got the time stop, that might've worked out. I'm not going to lie to you. Oh man. Mm. The time stop would have been clutch. Let me actually keep trying this because this might be a decent, uh, team loader. Actually burn damage is actually OP against bosses. I'm not going to lie, man. I mentioned it in the last video as well, but like you guys are seeing it in, in, in 4k here. Okay. We got the time stop to proc that worked out. Oh my God. He got it again. Oh my God. Oh my God. Jotaro. 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 Oh my God, brother. Okay. This is, this is, I'm dead. Wow. Oh my God, man. I just need better support, uh, support cards. I'm not gonna lie gang, but yo, that, that actually almost did it. We almost got him down. I'm gonna do some testing, right? So Nami, Nami does like that card. Um, that was, I was actually pretty good. <laughs> but I just wanted to see how much she does compared to like me using the crimson uh, girl. So it's about the same actually. So it doesn't matter if I use Nami or not. So I think it's best if I probably use Jotaro first so I can see if I can get the, uh, the time stop proc early on or not, or rather, rather, actually it's better to get fire first and then, uh, Jotaro to time stop. Oh, very nice. This is actually daytime right now, guys. So, um, let me try out Escanor then in the party and then we'll put baby girl last. So let, let's see how good Escanor is. Um, actually we can try him out first. Um, and, and that saves us the hassle of having to go through the whole battle to see how he does. All right. So let's see. Um, what? <laughs> That's it. That's all he does. That's it. Ah, Dios mío. Okay. I'm not, I'm not just playing escort no normal. That, that man is trash. I'm not going to lie to you gang. Okay. I call this the RNG squad. I'm not going to lie to you, brother. If this deck wins it, it's going to be phenomenal. So not to do your thing, burn it. That's right, Jotaro, please, time stop. Yes! Okay, we got the time stop. Good. Jotaro, yes! Oh my god, Jotaro, you bastard. Itadori. Uh, I need I need Itadori to do uh you know times five. If he does times five, I think we might be able to do it. The only problem is when he revives, he's probably gonna smack us. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you, gang. And to be honest, before um this update, oof, we got the times five to proc guys, but it's the time stop didn't work, so it's, it's no bueno. Oh, man. But yeah, before this update, um Natsu was absolutely busted. He would literally just burn infinitely on a unit, and now it's just three three turns of burn. So that's very unfortunate. I'm not gonna lie to you. Okay, well Jotaro is going absolutely crazy right now, brother. Times five, please. Oh my god. Yeah, Jotaro went crazy. He did so many time stops, but it was it was to no avail because we got whooped. Oh my god, Jotaro, ju bro, I don't know if I remember to show this to you guys, but he literally used a substitution log, dodged, and then time stopped. <laughs> oh my god, bro, wow, this is so tough. I'm not gonna lie, gang. I'm gonna use uh, a corrupt potion. I'm gonna use a boss potion. I'm gonna use a. Uh, star potion oh my god no we got yugi <laughs> dude I, I don't really know bro like i probably should be using this on a better weather but like at this point gang i'm not gonna hold you like i, I need better cards and okay we got goku yo yo these these, these buffs are actually working gangatron hold on all right let's re-roll the weather right right now it's um it's, it's literally nothing i don't think to be honest okay so we got rain Garbo. Let me do it again. Did I just get rain again? Bro, come on, bro. Let me get let me get manga, bro. Let me get eclipse. Let me get Easy Kai Galaxy. Something, brother. What did I just get? I got sandstorm. Uh, oh my god. 
Okay, yo, I, I took Nami back on the team, brother, and she dodged like mad times. Oh my God, Natsu? Hello? All right, I think we're cooked. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, we're cooked. Jotaro, time stop. We're cooked. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell brother we got close though we got close i'm not gonna lie it's just tough especially considering the fact that it's like these support cards like they're good to have but i don't think they stack at all like there's just no way right because like look if i have four cards does that mean like it doesn't say it doesn't stack though but that's a 40 percent chance to dodge my attack i mean to dodge incoming attacks so let, let, let's try this out let's see okay and okay so how about how about how about here hold on wait for it dodge dodge okay time stop okay all right dodge out okay all right cool okay wait a minute okay we dodge this time dodge again <sighs> all right no worries if i can get baby girl over here to dodge that would be great i'm not gonna uh brother okay just that old time stop but i don't think it even matters to be honest yeah it, it didn't it didn't even matter oh <gasps> oh Jotaro. Oh my god, Jotaro almost did him in. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, Jotaro has done it. Jotaro has done it, guys. He has done it. Jotaro, please. Time stop him. All the way. Oh, he dodged. Jotaro, please. Oh my god, dude. He almost did it. <laughs> Yo, Jotaro is really stupid, broken, brother. Oh my god. Oh my god. Finally, I got a log chance on this girl. Like, this is what I need. Like, I need a, a log chance or substitution chance on her and Jotaro. Uh, he, he didn't even... Oh, my God. He dodged again. And he didn't get the time stop. Oh, my God. Like, that's that's what I need. If I can get lucky like that, then I can definitely get this uh, boss battle done. But otherwise, this boss battle is just... It's not going to happen with the deck that I have, for sure. Anyways, you know what, guys? I'm going to wrap up this video here. That's pretty much all they've added into this uh, new update. Uh, I've showed you guys the support cards. And actually... To go a step further, um, the support party, I, I don't think it stacks because, um, you know, the way I was thinking was it that they all added up, but I, I they're literally just support to the main party per slot. If that makes sense. So this wooden log would be the support for Nami. This wooden log would be the support for Salamander. Um, conversely, if I switch over to the ninja chest, for example, on the last one, then the ninja chest would only apply to Jotaro. So I think that's literally how the support system works, but uh pretty cool how they added a support deck um into the game and stuff like that uh would be nice in my opinion i don't know if you guys would think this would be too far-fetched but if they added like trap cards and trap decks and stuff like that <laughs> maybe that's like supports i don't know but um that would that would be pretty cool as well um just my opinion though but all right i'll catch you guys in the next update slash video on this game if i get something really cool and i have to show off like just how i obliterate uh bottles but i'm out of here